Hi sweeties, it's your girl Demetra, Sweet Savant, and today I am participating in the End of Summer Tablescape Challenge hosted by Kimberly Davis of Diva Designing on a Dime. Thank you Kimberly for uh, posting this open invite. This is a great way to say goodbye to summer. Oh, I know it's sad, but we've got to say so long to the summer, summer, summer time, summer time. And we've got to get into sweater weather and fall. But before we do that, let's have one more celebration of the end of summer. So let me show you what I did for my tablescape. Um, oh, and the challenge part is that you have to incorporate fruit into your tablescape. So I'll show you how I do that. And well, let's just jump right into it, all right? Let's go, sweeties. So to start building my tablescape, I wanted a tablecloth with a really bold floral pattern, something really big. So this is what I went with, a dark background and some pretty roses on it. And this is our end of summer picnic. We're gonna use these on our place settings, but I thought it was the perfect time for an out, I'm sorry, an indoor picnic, not an outdoor picnic. We're gonna keep it inside and we're gonna use this picnic basket. I'm gonna use these wood slices again, this time as chargers. And then maybe we'll use these little strawberry baskets. If I can get it out. Little strawberry baskets in the center of our plate. Yeah, I think I like that a little bit better. Now, what are we gonna put in these strawberry baskets? For our first course, in this strawberry basket, we're gonna serve strawberry jam, because of course, some cheese and some bread. We've added some candlesticks for some romance. Now all I have to do is get some flowers and fill that basket. So to start building my floral display, I'm adding some palm fronds from a plant that I already had outside. I had an orchid already and I just stuck that with the pot and all right down in there with some of the uh, Spanish moss to cover up the pot. And I'll keep layering this with greenery and flowers until I get a nice lush look. Okay, so I am really happy with the way my picnic basket floral centerpiece is looking. I have filled it more with some greenery, some ferns from outside, and I've got a mix of real and artificial flowers. That is a real orchid. I've had this orchid for about two months. It just keeps going and going. And then I've layered in some artificial flowers like this. I guess that's supposed to be like a tulip or something. And then that's an artificial, like a zinnia maybe? And cone flower or something. I just think that it adds so much color and vibrancy mixed in with the real greens and the real flowers. It, I love it. I'm super happy with the way it came out. It's just to me like fireworks, like like a real exciting, let me move this candle out of the way. Real just exciting explosion of florals. So oh, I've got some fruit cut, and I like to have some of the exposed part of the fruit. I just think it's so pretty, all the sections of the pink grapefruit and the limes, and oranges, and all of these colors pull from our tablecloths, the pinks, the greens, a little bit of yellow in there, some orange. And don't worry, this fruit is not gonna go to waste because I'm gonna make a citrus tart later. I'll post the video from that. I'll put it, where is it, up there? Maybe it's up here. Somewhere in here, there will be a link to a video of a citrus tart because citrus is, it can get expensive. Thankfully, I found so much for so cheap, but we're still not gonna waste it. So yeah, we're gonna do 
a citrus tart. We're gonna do a gluten-free crust. And um, I just feel like it really came out nice because the flowers kind of tie back in with the floral arrangements here. The colors link back, the oranges, the greens. I'm just super happy with the way it came out. And I will give you a shot of the whole table. Oh, sweeties, I hope you enjoyed my farewell to summer, my end of summer tablescape. I really am sad to see summer go, but kind of excited about cooler temperatures. So um, I hope you like the tablescape. Um, oh, I think I forgot to tell you, this basket was from Home Goods. Um, I got it at on clearance at the end of the season, so it was a great deal. Um, the artificial flowers are from Dollar Tree, uh, the fruit was from Kroger, and this cake stand, which I just love, I got these also on clearance at Michael's, the strawberry baskets, these also from Michael's, I think, oh, these candles were from, from Home Goods, and the candle sticks are from Goodwill and the table covering is from Amazon I hope you enjoyed this video I enjoyed doing it please subscribe to my channel for more tablescapes more recipes more fun thanks so much sweeties and have a delicious day